Wow, that's so cool. I hope you love this intro. This is Sushan. I am your Luma Fusion coach from Switch to Y. In this video, we are going to learn how to create cinema graph effect. For those who don't know what is cinema graph, cinema graph is a technique which is very much famous among photographers and created in 2011 by the two photographers called Jamie Becky and Kevin Burke. They use this technique to showcase their fashion and news work. So let's learn how to create this in LumaFusion. Let me turn on the iPad screen. Let's start. Let me show you some example that I have shown you in the start of the video. Okay. There are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 examples showing cinema graph effect. Over here, I have created a masking. So, I am going to teach you how to create this masking. It is very simple. Let me turn off this layer. See, everything is moving right now. As I turn on this masking, see, the water is freeze and you can see waterfall is unfreeze. See. In the second, water is unfreeze and people are freeze. In the third, you can see the cars are moving and the cars are freeze. In this, you can see the person is waiting for the train and train is moving. Over here, the person is looking to the window and you can see the train moving. Over here you can see the water is freeze and people are moving. Over here you can see the waterfall is unfreeze and water is freeze. This is so cool. Let's learn how to create this. Let me copy this first example. Let's start with this first clip waterfall one and move playhead to the starting point you can start from the starting point or from the end point like this but i'm starting from the there is no thumb rule whether you want to start from the start point or anything you can select any frame you want okay but i'm selecting from the starting point and tab on export take a snapshot of it like this and you have to start a app called affinity photo in affinity photo tab on plus you can import from photos and from the reason we are going to select this okay now we will create a masking using the pen tool here we are not going to use any green screen blue screen nothing okay so select this pen tool from the left hand side and in the bottom you can select smart mode here are polygon mode line mode but we are going to select smart mode and start creating masking like this i'm doing little roughly like this you can skip the part if you want to. I have given the timestamp.
properly avoid the water From here, we are going to take a turn. joined it so we have created the masking like this and in the bottom you can select to selection like this and on the top you can select this selection tool and tab on feather selection tool like this select the radius of 1.5 or you can select one or two but in this case 1.5 is working enough like this and go back to this photo from the top menu like this now use first finger like this or you can use pencil like this and duplicate this selection now on the right hand side you can find this layer option you can hide this and see our masking is ready and tab on this export button from the top like this give the file name waterfall mask this and save it on the now bring that mask see it is a transparent mask to the luma fusion i have created the folder and now open luma fusion now find our mask like this where is it okay this is called waterfall mask you can bring this like this see It's animating everything. Turn on this mask. See everything is freeze. Okay. This is how you can create wonderful cinema graph effect. Let me show you more examples that I have created in Affinity Photo. See, I have cut this water portion. This one. Back the person, the car. Go back. We show you in the confusion. See this mask. See this mask. It's very easy. See this car one. Okay. It's very easy to create. I hope you love this video. Then give a big thumbs up. Share with your friends. See you very soon in the new amazing video. Till then, take care. Stay safe. Bye bye.